Um, yeah, I'll just talk about it more as, as the offense. The offense struggled. Uh, I mean, took us to our seventh drive before we got a first down. Um, so there's work to be done, a lot of work to, to be done. We'll just, uh, now we're, we've begun, which is, uh, which is positive, and we, uh, we, got, a place to, we got a place to start. Um, but yeah, offensively, there were some good things, um, not, uh, not near enough. You know, so uh, you know, it's back to work. You retool, you regroup, and uh, get back to work on Monday. Um, yeah, there, there were, uh, there were positives. I mean, there's too few, you know, uh, and that's never, I mean, never, I mean, you say it like the, you know, the quarterback struggled. It was, it was, I mean, it was offensive wide. Jim, are you, are you comfortable with, with the way that, that the backup quarterbacks and your offense looks with the Justin's injury right now? I don't think we're in a position to be comfortable. Uh, you know, we just gotta, we just gotta attack it. We gotta attack the, uh, um, you know, improvement. I think there's there's a lot there to be had, and uh, but yeah, comfortable is not the word I would use. You know, um, I, I don't think anybody on the offensive side of the ball would be would be would be happy with that. But um, let me you know address it. Uh, that's a it's eleven guys. You know, it's 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 the unit. Um, so back to work. What did you see as the, the issues offensively? <clears throat> we had some we had some run through in the running game. I mean, just got to be we're turning some guys loose. Um, yeah, there's issue issue in protection. Uh, we missed some throws. Uh, I mean, there's a quite a few things. Uh, offensive much, side, did you what did you think of the defense and special teams performance today? Yeah, there was uh, you know there was there was more good there. Um, you know, the incredible goal line stand that was uh, that was that was great. You know, we gave up five. Five first downs on, on the drive, uh, and we let some over routes get out. We let some some digs. We really didn't we didn't really cover those well. The dig the dig routes and and the overs. Um, so just missed uh, you know missed the timing on you know three blitzes or more that I can that I can think of right now. But they also had some uh, had some had some really good series too. Um, I thought uh, I thought our defense played. You know, winning football. I thought our special teams played winning football, and uh, you know, offensively, uh, you know, we 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 underperformed. What did you think of Joe Walton's performance? I think it, I think it was good. He got 21 plays. Uh, I uh, you know, I thought it was really solid. Joe belongs. How much uh, stock can you put into an offensive performance like this in a preseason game? You know, Greg obviously told us that this, you're not really scheming things up yet. You know, like with that in mind, how much stock can you really put in, in the performance as far as like where you guys are at? Um, I mean, it's a, I don't know. I don't have the uh, I don't have the answer of how much stock you could put into it. Uh, you know the um, you know whether it's the you know three first three and outs. I mean, we we had some we had some starters in there, some starters not in there. Uh, and so I don't know. I can't. I can't answer the question. How much? How much? Back to work. Back to work. We know where we're at. Um, you know. I think I could see several of the things we need to we need to improve and work on. And uh, and that's what we'll do. We'll go back to work and do it. When you go back to work, what's going to be top of your list that you feel like is the most important thing you guys got? To yeah, timing in the timing in the in timing blocking. Um, you know, in, in the run game. Uh, you know. In the zone blocking, the, the gap blocking, uh, the you know timing in the passing game, you know, the uh, protection, good at times, you know. Other times we uh, you know we missed, we missed, or one guy you know one guy got beat, uh, you know, or more on, on a play. So it was it's pretty pretty widespread, but uh, yeah, we, you go back and attack it. So will you? Continue looking outside the building for more competition in the quarterback room, like you guys did last week with bringing Luis. Yeah, anything's possible. Um, you know, right. Your top of mind right now is is getting 
getting on this film, and there's you know several several things to uh, to attack, and that's what we'll go about doing. Jim, defensively, uh, felt like. Up. All right, just defensively, it felt like you guys were successful with some blitzes, especially some of these defensive backs. Tar, you've got in there a couple of times. Thomas Harper. Yeah. What would you like about what Jesse was doing uh, scheme wise with some of the blitzes? Uh, there was, I mean, there was a lot, of, a lot of, a lot of real good. Um, I mean, just about everything really, just from from my on the field. Just we, the only things we didn't do right, and a ton of, you know, a lot of things right. Um, it, it, the things I previously mentioned, but uh, you know, everything else looked. Looked uh, looked really good. Jim, is, is everything uh, all right with Hayden Hurst? Uh, he seemed he seemed good. I mean, again, I mean that's we'll uh, we'll see, but that's uh, that's what he what, what he said. Pretty pretty nasty shot. Do you have to go through another week of practice to see who the preseason week two quarterback starter will be, or do you want to just get Easton back in there so he feels a little more comfortable? Uh to be determined, yeah, but I would I would say we're we're gonna look at it, evaluate all positions. Um, you know, this week, why wouldn't we? I mean, yeah, we're not naming a the backup week two starter at quarterback right now. I will let let this week's practice this week's uh, practice reps determine that. Wait, Fair enough, right? right? Are you saying East, Easton is not the starter next week? <laughs> I said I'm not naming it. Okay. Not naming the week two, you know, st starting quarterback. We'll let practice determine that. Okay. I, I guess I guess I'm asking because it, 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 it felt like East it was Easton felt like Easton was the 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 guy who who is the backup who would be the starter. So are you, he's in like an open competition still. Easton is. I don't think we're gonna have a backup. I mean, we're not gonna have a. I'll talk about. Uh, I say what I'm saying is I will talk about controversies, quarterback controversies when it's when it's talking about the starter, the starting quarterback. I, I'll be glad to to have those discussions. But I'm not going to have starting controversies over the left guard or the the right guard or the backup quarterback or the third quarterback or the second running back. We just you, you have my word. If we're ever into a uh, a into a quarterback controversy, uh, which I, I do not anticipate at all. Uh, but yeah, if you have my word, I will, I will discuss it with you all. But by the same token, I won't be going to uh, other position controversies. Is there anybody who surprised you positively, either on offense or defense tonight? Yeah, there was, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, that'd be, a, that'd be a long list. I hate to. I'd hate to you know, really start throwing out names and why'd you name this one and not this one. Uh, I, I thought the Shane Lee made a heck of a play on the goal line. That was that was outstanding. Um, and there's you know there was other. I thought we were getting some push from our uh, defensive line. I thought our Thule was I mean, it looked like they couldn't block him. Uh, I mean there was there was a ton of good things. What'd you uh, um, Troy Dye. Had a heck of a game, really was playing well. Um, so several, several, several really, really good things. Cameron Dicker, I mean, a 58-yard field goal. I mean, we're gonna we're gonna remember that for a long time. And the whole, the whole, you know, snap, hold, protection was really good. I mean, there's uh, you know, a lot of good things, just not not enough overall to, you know, to be to to win the football game. For the first time in a game situation, what do you think of the whole kickoff thing? Uh, it was interesting. It was, I mean, it was, it seemed pretty, pretty good. I mean, I was, what do you think? I thought it was good. I was, you think that I thought our guys played work? well. I thought our, I mean, yeah, we popped that first one. Um, and, you know, we covered, we covered one really well. I mean, that, it's interesting. It is, a, is an interesting. Uh, I thought our guys were were um, were schemed up well. I thought they I th thought they played, you know, played the play, you know, with the uh, with the intensity that that, that play deserves. And uh, yeah, it was it was good. A lot of th and a lot of things happened, right? You had a lot, you had a return. You had a couple of big returns. You had a you had a you had a big stop cover. You had one that didn't land in the landing zone. Um, yeah, it was, 
I thought we acquitted ourselves well, as I said before, you know, in special teams uh, throughout the night. Cameron hits a 58 yarder and then goes down and makes a tackle on the kickoff. Yeah, that, that was. That preseason game. There's going to be a lot to remember, you know. I mean, there's, there's, uh, there's definitely, you know, preseason game collectively for us as as a team, uh, you know, was it, uh, you know, it wasn't what we wanted. Uh, you know, wouldn't would call it less than, you know, because uh, it can be great, it can be good, it can be fair, it can be bad, you know, it could be, it could, uh, you know, it could be horrific, um, you know, don't think it was that. But uh, individually, I thought there were some, you know, some people that could really put themselves, that was a great game, that was going to be, that's going to be, memor they're going to remember that for, for a really long time, and that can happen in the preseason. Uh, and that's definitely one. You hit a 50 yard, 58 yard field goal, and then make the tackle. And he, you know, felt great about it. And um, so that's that's kind of where it is, you know, in the preseason. When there's there's uh, and now no matter what, no matter what what it is collectively, no matter what it is for each each person individually, you know how they how they fared in that game. Uh, Either way, it's a learning experience, and, uh, and and that's why it's good to have it started. If it wasn't horrific, where would you grade tonight's performance overall? Um, yeah, uh, below average offensively. Um, you know, I thought we were, I thought we were winning football defensively, and and I thought winning football uh, in the special teams as well. So. Good special teams, good defense, below average offensively. Do you anticipate a junior playing this uh, preseason? We'll see. We'll see. Uh, yeah, and I'm don't uh, not qualified to predict that. And is uh, Darius working through something? Yeah. What did you see from the uh, running backs tonight? Obviously, competition behind Gus and J.K. with Jared, Elijah, Isaiah. Those three guys. Yeah, I thought all three. Uh, you know. Had really good moments. Um, you know, ran durable, ran hard. Um, you know, Isaiah was. I was pleased. I mean, he had a couple. Had had a couple really good runs. Caught the ball in the backfield. Got out of bounds. Heads up on the, in the two minute. Uh, you know, Dot was a, uh, workhorse. So was Jay Pat. Um, yeah, I thought they acquitted themselves. Well, they they'll, they'll walk out feeling pretty good, um, about their performance. I would think. And they went into it that way. They went in confident and, and, and ready to play. Um, good, good, and good for all three of those running backs. I'm sorry, I keep cutting you off. Um, your first time coaching in the NFL in about a decade, how did you feel? Like, was it good to get reps? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know how different it could be, but. It was. It was good. It was good. I, uh, it felt really good. I'd have to, I'd have to. Quote the old singing cowboy, Gene Autry, it was good to be back in the saddle.